Many of us at home are accessing our sessions using an Apple iPad. This is a great option to have and very user friendly. So, what happens when you click that join button in your CareVisions email? You may be asked to firstly download Zoom. You can go ahead and follow the prompts which are provided for you to go either to the App Store or you can also download directly from Zoom itself. If you have already downloaded Zoom, your access to sessions should be very straightforward. But if you require some assistance with this, please see my previous video entitled Downloading Zoom. The first thing you may need to press is the blue launch meeting button in the center of your screen. It will often open automatically, but you can press this to open your session. It will then ask you if you wish to join the session with or without video. This means, do you want others to see you? Simply choose whether you prefer to join the session with video or not by clicking either join with or without video. You can also change this once inside your Zoom meeting room. You will then see a waiting room screen saying, please wait, the meeting host will let you in soon. You will also see the title of the class, letting you know that you are in the right place. Very close to the scheduled session start time, you will be admitted into the Zoom room. You will see a connecting notification. Next, you will see a white box saying, to hear others, please join audio. Simply click the top option of call using internet audio and you should now hear what is being said by others within the Zoom room. Once inside your Zoom room, the great news is, is that there are only really one or two very simple icons that you will need to enjoy your session. Tap anywhere on your screen to illuminate the toolbar in the top right hand corner. You have various options, but there are only really a few that you will need. If you cannot hear your session, click on the green arrow with a set of headphones above it saying join audio. To best view your tutor, we often recommend that you select active speaker, which is on the left of your screen. You can also choose gallery in order to see other guests within the session, but most sessions are improved by prioritizing your tutor's screen. To send a message to the host, concierge, or share with other members of the group, you can use the chat function. Simply tap on the three dots in the very top right hand of your screen entitled More, and then tap Chat. Here you can select whom you would like to chat with by tapping the blue arrow and searching for Stephanie dash digital concierge. You can then type a message to Stephanie and I will be right there behind the scenes in most sessions to help and advise you with all queries. And now you're ready for your classes in Zoom.